Hi everyone, my name is Mara. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And in this video I'm going to do an updated Meet My Rats. Because apparently I just acquired more and more rats. And some of them pass away of course as they have a really short lifespan. So I need to update you on all of my rats. And while I do that, I opened rats cage and we'll see if they want to come out and play. And in the meantime, I'll tell you about them and try to show you and I'll try to show you each one of them if they want to be caught okay I'm going to take out just a few <laughs> because they don't want <laughs> to come out so first up we have Blue and his friend Jesse I adopted the two of them because uh, they're Owners realized that their daughter is um, allergic to rats and they already had uh, five of their babies from an oops litter and so I decided to get the parents too. Of course, Blue is paid. Blue is a top-eared blue rat, hence why the name Blue. And uh, Jesse is a Dumbo Rex rat. They are really sweet. They are now a bit over one and a half years old, so they are getting older. Jessie doesn't show her age at all, but Blue does a little bit. He's a bit slower and yeah, he likes sleeping and uh, not much else. Then, as I said, before I had them, I got five of their babies. Sadly, one of them got sick and passed away last year, but I still have four of their babies. I have uh, three Aguti females. We have Tina, Cindy and Dolly. Again, they are all a Guti, Top Yard, and uh, Dolly is also Rex. They are my crazy girls, they are now all really chubby, and they still love having fun playing around and everything else. I also have their brother, Raffaello, and he is very fat. Yeah, this is Raffaello, as you can see, he's a big boy. As you can guess, his favorite activity is eating. He's a husky, he's really fat, and I don't know why everyone else has a good weight, not him. I don't know how that happened. But he's also an active rat, loves life, sometimes goes <laughs> free roaming with the girls, sometimes not all the times. <laughs> so yeah, at a point in time, uh, at the end of last year, in December, I had six rats. As you can see, I have a huge cage, I can get more rats. And so a friend of mine told me I want to get rats. I was like, okay, perfect. I sent her lots of rings to read. And then she asked me to recommend her where to get rats from. So I recommended a reputable breeder in Bulgaria because we don't have any reputable breeders in Romania. She was like, okay, I'm going. And I said, wait, if you are going, bring me some rats too. So talking to the breeder, I picked uh, one girl and she also had one girl she was supposed to keep for her, but she was like, okay, I'll give her to you so that you can get two girls. And even before my friend could go and get the Bulgaria vets, I stumbled upon a reptile breeder's house, and I was in his uh, feeder rats breeding room, and I fell in love with two little girls, and I couldn't leave them to be snake food. And so they came to me. This is Hazi, and she's my best friend. <laughs> She she and also Pink, her sister, uh, they were both really sick when I got them. They had a sinus infection and they were too tiny to do tests on them because the nose swab wouldn't fit in their nose. But thankfully after two or three months for Halsey of treatment, she is now perfectly healthy and uh, she's so happy and so friendly. I got really lucky with their temperament. But I also th think that taking her out every day to do her treatment contributed to how friendly she is. So yeah, this is her, she's so sweet. She's a... ow. <laughs> she's a fawn hooded. And I love, love, love the fawn colors. So this is why I chose the little girls. And this is Pink, the girl I took with Halsey. Uh, she was, I think, like two weeks younger than uh, Halsey when I took her and as you can sh see she's a uh, apricot I think the color is called so it's the one with the red eyes so she's the 
apricot berkshire, dumbo and they are just too cute to let them be eaten by snakes so I took them in I don't regret it, I don't recommend it also um, again, they had so much treatment before they were healthy and uh, yeah, doing nebulized treatments twice a day for three months straight isn't fun but I'm glad they are mine and that they are nice and healthy so the same morning as I was uh, going to the reptile house, the Bulgarian breeder posts some new babies and she posts one fully black baby rat and I was like, oh my god, I'm in love I text her, hi, can I get this one instead of the one you wanted to keep for yourself? and she was like, yeah, sure, but I have two black rats do you want them both? I was like, yeah, okay, if it's easier for you, I can take both of them because I have space Bear in mind, this is before I picked the two feeder rats. So she's like, yes, perfect. You can take... So you'll take all three rats? And I was like, yes. Three little girls for me, please. And so... Um, yeah. Like, two weeks later or something, three more girls came into our lives. So first off, we have Cher. She's the oldest one. I reserved first. She's a black hooded Dumbo. A normal color but I really wanted to see how the temperaments are for the breeder rats and I really love all three of them they're so calm and so brave I really like that she's so cute she's my little baby yeah, this is Cher and this is the rat that uh, made me get three rats instead of two from Bulgaria this is Whitney and she's a fully black rat even her belly she has just the teeny tiniest bit of white on her toes and I love her so much. She's so beautiful and so dark and so sweet and so cute. She's a little baby. And Amy doesn't want to come out. But she is what they call a black Irish. She has this little white bit on her belly. Yep, they're really sweet. So this, these are all my rats. So in total I have 11 rats. Two males, spade, and nine females. So yeah, this is my uh, gang of rats. Hope you like the video. Hope you like seeing them roam around in the background. And I'll see you next time. Bye.